right here, and here is the So Kawaii box for December. Um, at least this came on time, because it is themed Magical Christmas, and it is currently the uh, 10th, I think. <laughs> so it is well into, well, near the start of December, right? Almost the middle of December, but before Christmas. So, let's see. So it says, your Sokai monthly box from Japan. And it is huge. The main reason why I got this, because as you probably know, I have skipped quite a few. Hopefully I will not dislodge anything behind there. Um, or let's just put this to the side and I'll, I'll put it in my lap and I'll put the items as we go onto the table so I have space. This lovely pink uh, tissue paper, that's the word. Okay, so as I said, this is December 2019, Magical Christmas. Um, on the back is obviously the cheat sheet. So let's see what's inside. So first up, we've got this. It is a Sanrio Eco bag. So basically it's like a tote bag. Become a real Santa Claus this year and bring gifts everywhere you need with this cute Sanrio Eco Bag. It's foldable to take up less space during your shopping session. This bag comes with three ador comes in three adorable designs, each one available at random. So here we've got pom pom pudding. So you know it's like officially. Licensed. So it's, it says monthly box from Japan, and obviously, what's things inside is made in China, as always. Here's what it looks like. Okay. So that's how you fold it. Huh. So, there's that. Pom pom pum. So basically, First, fold up nice and small, like And this is, oh I see, this is kind of like elastic in here, so all you need to do is just kind of put it like that, I don't know, fold it however you want, kind of like that. Then you can have this little clippy bit to clip on, so that's pretty neat. I mean you can never have too many bags, so yeah, that's good. Of course, that's probably not the right way you'd fold it, but there we are. See, now out of two different bags, I've gotten a foldable bag like this. Because the first first bag I ever got was that uh, was this one right here. I actually have it next to me on the desk. This one from the uh, Harry Potter box. So, next up... Well... I had to uh, briefly uh, stop recording because my mom came in. Okay, so next up, randomly going into this, is this thing, which is backwards obviously. This is the Sanrio Christmas Edition poster. Mm. This cute Christmas Edition plushie is from Sanrio. 
uh, will instantly get you that festive feeling. Hang it on your Christmas tree for the best effect or add it to your collection of cute plushies. Either way, your home will be cuter than ever. Six plushies available at work. So I got this little guy. And the question is, which one was he? <laughs> um, Mm. Well, obviously he's not part of the little twin stars, right? Um, obviously not the bear one. Uh, I am so bad at names. <laughs> Alright, he's pretty cute. Like a little Santa getup with this little bag of goodies. And this. Super soft. Let me tell you that. Oof. Oh yes. Here he is. I knew his name was on the tip of my tongue. Cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll. Oh yeah. Awesome. It's got this uh, ball and chain thing, so you can hang it up need be, I can even hang it on one of my tough magnets on my phone. Can I do that? But it's just so super soft. Ooh. The stuffing in the hat too. But it's so super soft. Ooh, that feels nice. All Japanese ones feel nice. So, I'm gonna just sit there for a sec. Ooh, and as you see, this is from my first Sanrio, uh, Soko e box, this cup. I don't actually drink out of it though. I got loads of cups. So I use it for my paint. Well, you know, the water cup for the paint. Okay. Next up. We have this. Ooh. I'm just staring at it. Because it's got so many shaky bits and so sparkly. Okay. You want to see it? Here it is. Um, it's it's it moves. See the stars move. Cool. And I'm actually glad it's this type of hairbrush because a normal kind of bristly hairbrush, my hair just does not do anything with it. My hair is so thick and stuff. So this one I can actually use. Awesome. And it's huge, which is good. Let's see, what does it say? Sanrio hairbrush. Though it does say it was Pokemon, Sanrio, and card captors on this, but there is one, two, three, four Sanrio products, one Pokemon, and one card captors, which is kind of disappointing. Because I'm hoping for at least, I don't know, maybe another Pokemon product and another card captors, so it like evens it out. But it's not evened out. It's Sanrio heavy. Which is okay if you love Sanrio, but I'm not really a total, total fan of it. So it is slightly disappointing for me. And I did mainly get it for the card capture item that they showed would be in here. But anyway, uh, let's see. Uh, add a touch of magic to your everyday beauty routine with this pretty hairbrush from Sanrio. Shaped like a star and filled with s with sparkles, this is definitely the cutest beauty accessory for every kawaii enthusiast out there. Two, two designs available at random. So I'm guessing it's uh, Kur Kur Kuromi and My Melody are the two designs, I guess. Anyway. So I, I do like the uh, sparkles inside though. Just so... Cool. I do like that. that. That's a plus. Okay, so next up is this thing. Let's just say I'm getting all the Sanrio things out of the way. Though, so, okay. Oh, there it is. I almost did not spot. I almost not spot the Pokemon on him, it was so thin. Right. Ooh. 
Interesting. It seems you can put this in the microwave. But I know what this is because it actually says so in English. It's a medium sized food bag. But I don't put it down because I don't know if my camera angled that way. Anyway, it's a little twin star food bag medium. There are six inside with the uh, dimensions of uh, 180 by 220 millimeters. Um, kind of looks like that. Okay. And by the looks of it, Well, it's got the normal, you know, San Rio sticker here for the uh, licensed bit. But by the looks of it, you can put liquids in it. You can put it in the microwave. Um, you can put raw meat in it. Or does that mean it's supposed to be airtight? And you can put soup in it. Okay, it's basically a normal food bag, just medium in size. Okay. It's usable, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not sure what to do with it, besides... I don't know. Because normally you wouldn't really keep... Well, you wouldn't really normally reuse food bags much. Especially if they had raw chicken and stuff in it. Well, it is something useful, so... Yeah. Okay, I can live with that. So let's see what it says. Sanrio food bags. With these Sanrio food bags, you have no more excuses to eat Christmas leftovers again. And again. You can either use it for food or any other things you might think of in your, in your box. You'll get either... My Little Twin Stars, or My Melody. And we got My Little Twin Stars. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we have two items left. Let's go for the um, Pokemon, because it's on the side and it's much smaller than the other thing. I don't know what it is. It's a cloth, but it looks like it. Um, okay, okay, that's just, read it out, because I know, like, in anime, they wrap their lunch boxes, bento boxes, in cloth while they transport it. But anyway, let's see. Uh, Pokemon Furoshiki. There is a strong wrapping culture in Japan. This item is a traditional and made in Japan. Furoshiki featuring four beautiful Pokemon designs printed for each season. Summer, autumn, winter, and spring. Your loved ones will be impressed by your wrapping skills. And I got autumn. You'd think they'd put winter in this one, because it is December and labeled magical Christmas. But okay. The summer would have been interesting to see. Autumn's not really my favorite. Here, but there we go. So that is interesting. You got a cloth with Pikachu on it. Looks like Pikachu in a few different positions. Well, that should be interesting. Something to uh, wrap things in. Not sure about that one. But okay. Right. So we have one last item left, and it is the main reason why I got this, because it is the lovely, that lovely pink wrapping paper. I mean tissue paper. I'll keep for later. Now I have to admit, still the inside of the box is super cute, though it's the same as last time. So this box is way bigger. 
So let me just briefly put the box here. It's all everywhere. I'll just move this to the side so I have space. I need space for this. I'll just do some cinnamon over there. And ta da! We have. Ta da! A card cactus, Sakura figure. Technically, its name is Card Captor Sakura. Clear card, junior high school uniform, special figure. That is a long name, but there we go. Um, let's see what it says. You never thought of having a beautiful anime figure from Japan included in your box? Well, we did it. We are sure, pretty sure this adorable Sakura figure will find a special place in your collection of kawaii items. Oh look, Kara-chan is also featured. Because he is so cute! Look at him! Awesome! Where am I going to put it? <laughs> you know, I still have two SAO figures I have not unboxed yet because I even know where to put it. But, this one seems to be just a single thing, not really... You know, similar like my other SAO figures over there because you don't move, which is great. I know some people prefer fig arts because you can pose them and stuff, but they're so hard to balance. <laughs> okay, um, I forgot to read the uh, the magical Christmas thing on the inside, in the middle. Okay, so thank you for ordering the Sokari December box, the last of 2019. In this box, we celebrate both Christmas and our first birthday. This month, you will get a bigger box, full of surprises featuring not only Christmas-themed, but also cute and useful items as usual. For the first time ever, we included a beautiful card after soccer figure, as well as products from Sanrio and Pokemon. Technically, it's mainly Sanrio, yeah? Um, the whole team is wishing you a wonderful holiday season and a Merry Christmas, full of kawaii presents. See you next month with a wonderful January box to get off to a great year. Yes, I have trouble reading straight lines. Um, yes, the theme for January, by the way, is winter celebrations. Because technically January is still winter. So is February. But anyway, so that is the next theme. The, uh, um, yes. So, let me just snip off the tape. Come on, tape. Move. Okay. And one more on the side. Wink. Okay. Normally I probably put this in an, in its own video, but technically right now, I have so many pins left to record. I don't need to make another video. Okay, so first peek of this is it's in bubble wrap. Okay, so here we have it's in little sections. Great. Okay, so we'll show you Caro first because I am getting him first. If I can get him out, just the bubble wrap. That's okay. So here we have Cameron. Doesn't he so cute? This means that he rests in our arms and I might lose him. But anyway, though with this you can also and fall put him hanging on a cup. Anyway, obviously I'm not doing that. <laughs> Put the cup back where it belongs. Well, not really belongs there, but... Okay, cinnamon. Okay. So that... is the cute Carol. And the video. Little wings. It's very little detail on this. And if you look close enough, he can see. I'll take better pictures after. But this little guy is winking. 
so cute. Okay, we just place them down over here so I don't lose them. I don't lose them anyway. Knowing me. Okay, there's the stand. Nothing too special about this. It just says copyright and China on the back. Nothing too grand about that one. Now, here we have Sakura. So, you know, here's the feet, shoes, there, and there's the bag. Very straight looking, shiny bag. Skirt. Little frilly bits on the inside skirt. Shirt bit. Then we got like the tie bit. Scroll crest there. We got the face and the hair. Lovely gradient. Gradient gradiently like painted like. Awesome! So here we have this. Fit her foot in there properly. Aha! It's in! If you did not hear that, well, something's wrong with your speakers. <laughs> so now we have Caro just sitting, resting, right there. This is what I mean by winky face. Don't worry. That's where he is. Oh, so cute. Very lovely. Okay. Well, obviously, as you can see, we're not time looking at it. My favorite and main item I got this for, this box for, is this lovely card capture software, clear card picture. Now, that concludes this box. Now, I don't know if I'm going to get the next one, because, uh, well, I just have a feeling it might be Sanrio mainly, but I don't think there's any figures in the next one, so probably might not get it. But it does have Sailor Moon in it, but I did do a sneak peek. Check out their Instagram and they do post their sneak peeks on there too. Um, so yes, so to sum it up, we got this lovely soft, super, super soft, I just really love softness of all Japanese plushies. I mean, those are great, even though they're made in China, but they're so soft and fluffy. I love it. Oh, it's like my marshmallow plushie, which I got at a convention that cost me about 40 pounds, but still, it was so soft. I mean, I still sleep on it. So, we have this super softness, Santa dressed cinnamon roll, the lovely sakura, the pom-pom pudding uh, eco bag, basically just a reusable shopping bag, and then we have this lovely Kurumi hairbrush, this um, 
useful medium food bag and this Pokemon cloth wrapping thing. Yes, it has a proper name and its proper name is Furoshiki. So that is everything. If you wanted to have a closer look at each one. Just pause. <laughs> so that is everything. So thank you for watching. Like, subscribe for more. Ring the doorbell for notifications. Over and out.